And if you're watching on stream, it's time to continue. Okay, so we're back to Connor and Hank. Connor's alive! Yes! Connor's alive! Yes! Because I killed him, remember? Oh, thank God. I was so sad. Oh no, they probably reset his memory like they did with Kara. Although Hank will respect us a lot more. This is good, this is good. Oh, I'm so excited he's alive. I thought I killed him. Jesus Christ. My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed. Cyberlife Cyber transferred, transferred its memory, memory and sent me to replace it. You died, you died in, in my arms. arms. And now and you're, you're back, back here, here as if nothing happened. happened. Fuck, Fuck you. you. Hey, I saved your life. Why are you so annoyed with me? Chris. Who's Chris? And that might be a son. I heard Officer Chris, Chris attacked attack by DDs last night. Yeah, he was, he was in the wrong place at the, the wrong time. time. Yeah, like I saved you and you don't even thank me. He's still, he's still in shock, shock, but at least he's alive. Thank me for saving your life, would you? Put me through an awful lot of stress. It's a lady from the lobby. Hi. Uh, I'm, I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Anderson Detroit, Detroit Police Department. Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. She's the first android ever made. She's the one in the lobby when you're in the main menu. She's the one standing there. I'll let Elijah know you're here. But please make yourself comfortable. Wait for the android. What the hell? Is this the guy that made androids? Is she with him because he made androids and she was the first android made? I'm not reading that. Can I, I talk to her? Sincere. What does that mean? You're right. She's, She's really pretty. pretty. Can I talk to you? About me dying? His androids, androids haven't, haven't been, been a bad, a bad thing, thing for everybody. everybody. You're about, about to meet to your maker, maker Connor. Connor. How's, How's it, it feel? feel? Um, distant. I don't, I don't know. know. I'll tell, I'll you, tell you when I see him. Sometimes, Sometimes I wish I could, I could meet my creator face to face. God or something. Or nobody. I have a couple things I want to tell, tell him. See, I really like Hank, but he's such an idiot. I don't mean an idiot, he's so mean, but I like him. As like, with Connor. They're so like... They've got a weird relationship, but it's... So, so let's, let's continue. continue. So, so, is this Connor? Connor? I'm, I'm so, so glad Connor's not dead, because I honestly thought he was dead. Oh great, Amanda's gonna hate us, I know it. I already know it. I just know it. She didn't like us in the first place anyway. Well, she did like us. She's trusted. I mean, she used to get a bit annoyed with us. And now that we have, like, died for Hank, she's not going to appreciate it. Well, I don't think she would anyway. Oh, you're standing on thin ice there. Machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. Kamsky. I thought Kamsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Emotional. Kamsky was just playing with me. He didn't know anything. This place. Did Kamsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? 
It's not where does Cyberlife stand in all this? What do they really want? want? All Cyberlife wants is to resolve the situation and keep selling androids. Secret. You didn't tell me everything you know about Deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. I know we didn't trust her. Ask questions. I never trusted her. You're the only one who can prevent civil war. I didn't trust her. I don't find trust her. Deviants. No. Or there will be chaos. I am a deviant, sorry. This is your last chance, Connor. I hate Amanda. I just don't know what it is. I've got like I've got a feeling that she's not to be trusted. You're off the case. The FBI has taken all of it. What? But we're on to something. But we just need more time, I'm sure we can. You don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now. Not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to Cyberlife. No! I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Hank, help me, help me. He's still wearing his hippie shirt. We've got a path unlocked. He's our friend. I'm not leaving Hank. I don't want to go back to cyber life. Talk to Hank. I will, don't you worry. Explain. Fellow's right. Everybody's terrified they're Android Eternal. No, I didn't mean to say that. Why did I say that? So you're going back to cyber life? No, I don't want to. I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? Regrets. When the deviants rise up, there will be chaos. We could have stopped it. Now it's too late. When you refused to kill that android at Campsky's place, you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. I know. Empathy's a human emotion. Hank, you have to take us home. Troubled. I don't know why I did it. Hank secret. I know there are things that haunt you, Hank. But maybe you need to find the courage to move past them. Get on with your life. It's just a plastic cop's opinion, but I had to say it. Well, well, here comes Perkins. That don't take me away. Fucker. Sure, don't waste any time with the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. Hank, we have to do this. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. I like you, Hank, please. Thank you. Get a move on. I can't distract him forever. He's our friend. Take the key. We've only got. Take it. We've only got five minutes. Close to the archie room. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Hank. I really like Hank, he's, and we're friends now, so that's hey, always been the thing I've wanted. I'm talking to you, asshole. Great. Asshole, yes, I'm talking to you. Bye. <laughs> I don't know who that was. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> uh, 
evidence. Oh god. If Hank ever died, I'd be so sad. He's so nasty, but I just love him, like, as a character. Sumo. Maybe it's Sumo. Hank does. Would you not have Sumo? Oh, he'll be zero. Zero, I mean circle. Oh my god. There's Daniel. Jericho. Okay, put it back. It's doing nothing. Okay, this guy. Oh my god, it was him that we interviewed, remember? In inside what? I remember that guy. That was ages ago. Is it inside the statue? Wasting my time. Is it inside the statue? Maybe it's inside the statue because he went, it's inside, and the statue's letting us look in it. Yeah, let's have a look. Let's have another look. L1. It is inside! It is! But I'm clever, aren't I? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Not really, but. Jericho is somewhere in the front building. Now we can scan their memories and narrow the search. Maybe okay, cool. So now we know where it is. Oh, I remember him. Needed. I don't know what all these mean. Okay, something needed. I swear he took Alice. I I'm sure Alice might be an android. Okay. Let's take him. Wait, what are we taking? What is that? Oh, maybe we need to give it to him. If we rebuild these guys. What's the name of the deviants we're hiding? So do we need to wake them up? Yes, I need, we need to swap their parts, don't we? So I need to give this to him. I only have a few minutes, come on, speak to me. Hurry up, we don't have all day. Okay, then, can't just speak. Help. You can help me. I must find Jericho. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I am. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. Fine. I'll have a look myself, shall I? It's gonna be so rude about it. I'll find out myself. Jericho located. Thank you, sir. Did me no help. I've been about this since the first second I saw you. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the deviants. You're off the case. Oh God. And now it's gonna be definitive. Hank. Hank, help me. Oh, I picked the wrong one. I missed it. God, I'm not good at these quick things. 
Oh, two. I could tell two. Triangle. I'm not good at these things. I'm really not. I'm panicking. Oh, I clicked the wrong two. It's a lot of wrong stuff there. Oh no, I killed him back. At least we know where Jericho is. Run! Run, Connor, run! Last chance, Connor. Woo! Okay. Wow! It's the biggest map I've ever seen. Connor incapacitated. Incapacitated. <laughs> I'm going to try one more time. Connor incapacitated. I'm pretty sure I've never heard that word before. 63%. He incapacitated <laughs> Gavin. I don't know how to say it. Okay. So we located Jericho, which was 93 people did that as well. So we did quite a lot, only 17 got the map. See, I was clever. 17% of people got the map and I was part of that 17. See, clever move, clever move. Um, I usually look for what people did the least and that I did as well. Because uh, it's kind of surprising some things that people didn't do. So yeah, that's cool. Look at this though, look how big that section is to find the lo location of Jericho. At least we got it, because I bet some people ran out of time or something. Are you sure you should continue? Maybe... Maybe we should leave things as they are. That's really strange. Um, I just want to quickly say I'm sorry if my mic keeps going a little bit weird. I'm trying to stay as still as I can, because if I move, it's broken, so it's going to, like like move so if i do this or this it's just because i'm trying to see if the light is on because if it's on then it means it's working if it's off it means it's not working so let's resume anyway we haven't seen oh we're close with luther l1 oh yeah we're with rose oh dear about marcus because marcus happened this year Almost there. <gasps> that is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Alice is sleeping on Lufa. How cute is that? That's actually adorable. Not even joking. Right, let's play the media. At least we're going to Canada. Did you just tra change the news news radio? I was listening to that. Cool though, I love how the like seats turn and stuff like that. Don't help. Kara is literally like a mum to Alice. It's the cutest thing ever. Why are you circling around? What are you doing? A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safe from the other side. Oh my god, we're going to meet Marcus? Kara and Marcus? But it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. She will be. Thank you for everything. We're going to meet Marcus! None of the main characters have actually met each other yet. I don't think, anyways. Luther will. Aww, oh, I love Luther. He's such a dad. <laughs> Gotta look across the road before we go. K. 
quickly. Did she say it was in here? No? Where did she say it was? Locate Jericho. Oh, okay. This way. Um, where exactly are we going? Just over here? I'm following you, Luther. Look at him with Alice. How cute is that? They are literally the cutest of cuteness. <laughs> if that even makes any sense. Ferndale. What the hell is Connor doing? I think Connor's pretending to not be an android. Because even though he's a proper android, he's trying to find Jericho, isn't he? Yeah, because this is where Marcus was. This is how Marcus found Jericho. They're all going to meet each other. It's going to be great. I wish Hank was with Connor, though. I wish, like, all the androids had their own army, but Hank was with us, because he hates people anyway. I know he hated androids at the start, but he's going to love them, so it'd be dead cool if... Um, Hank was on the android side. That would be cool. Oh. I think we're going to meet Marcus, you know? I think it's happening. The warm place. There's a fire over there. Okay, don't need to watch the news. Where's Marcus? I don't know, but we, there's a fire over here, so at least it's warm for Alice. Cause she's an actual human. You forget that she actually needs stuff. She better have ate that spaghetti or else she's going to starve to death. A fever. She's got a fever. I'll try to find this one. The last boss is in two hours. And the troubles on the other side of town, we haven't got much time. We'll leave it as soon as we can pass on She has an eight. She didn't eat a spaghetti. I'll be back. Stay with us. Oh, why did you reject him? He was trying to tell you something really important. Maybe it was because she didn't eat a spaghetti. Find the deviant leader. They're all going to meet up. I want to see where, if Kara is there. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Luther's there! They're meeting up. I, I don't know why I'm so excited about them meeting up. It's just a really cool thing, you know what I mean? Oh, didn't mean to click that. Maybe he's upstairs. Got a feeling the leader's upstairs. Don't touch me. Lucy. She's the most damaged android I've ever seen. It's Kara, it's Kara. This is the moment they all finally meet. It's a me. It's a me! It's a me! You see it? It's a Kara and a Kara. <laughs> here he is. Well, on that note, we're going to leave this episode here. If you haven't already, don't forget to leave a big thumbs up, comment down below, and also hit that big red subscribe button. And it's kind of a cliffhanger, but it's a wait to see what comes tomorrow. So, um, yeah, I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye!